impact the body. So if you come in at me, here, come in here, I go this way. And then you've got So real simple, we're going to come in, we're going to do this one. Mm -hmm. We can walk out because he, he flipped over, we're going to walk out, pop, bang. Basic this up. Again, as it comes in, move the target. And a little top, a little tuck like that is good. And you come over, so watch again. He's going to try to stick it, boom. You get here, and you follow, bang, right into here. Oh, and that, that came right out. Okay? Again, he's like, oh. Watch closely, yeah, exactly. So one step, boom. Pushing this way, stepping aside, boom. He's going to pull back. See how that works? He pulls back. This is not a wrap, it's a position. See how that works? Isn't that cool? <laughs> You're like, good. Isn't that cool or what? <laughs> so if this comes in, right? So you come in, boom, he pulls back, boom. Here, not a grab. You're not trying to death grip it. It's just as he goes in, he's got to pull back. As he pulls back, you let him pinch your hand here. You just keep that on that side of your hand and then go up, push him in. Okay? That side. Step. Start with one step at a time. Right. The hand, remember, two hands. What did I tell you guys? Both hands are involved. There you go. See, now he's actually defending himself while he's attacking you. Exactly. Boom! There it is. Oh, yeah, exactly. So Just look, okay, so right. as soon as you get speed, there, they speed, it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. speed, you guys have seen this. Speed can get you in trouble. You've got to blend, you've got to blend with his movement. You don't go fast. You blend with his movement. So you stop me. You just blend with his movement. If you go fast, boom, there. Exactly. Okay? So you don't have to try to move quick. You just you blend. However fast you can, boom. We go, he pulls back, boom. straight forward, okay, or if he blocks here, okay, watch the block, if he just does the hand block, right here, okay, that's why two hands, all the way both hands, that's why you only use one hand, right, <laughs> both hands, one mind, one body, okay, good job. <laughs> You get a loose but solid grip, okay? Because you can flick the blade, okay? Because you may have to do that and then. Okay? Get familiar with whatever blade you're working with. Yes. Start knife fighting training for what I used to do today. I can take a knife and. When you step out, what I want you to do is step out a little further like this. So when you catch that, as you step in, go ahead and step right into him, and then turn the throw. So as he comes in here, that comes in, right? He draws back. So you step, you, you step forward to the side. He draws back. So then, go. Right. <laughs> so close the distance. Okay, do it again. That's not what I'm trying to do. But hey, step, you step, go step, do it. Step. There you go. Boom. Now blend it. Now you got it. Now twist him down. There you go. Okay. If you want it two more times, you need to step behind. Hey, step behind? Yep, you need to. Hey. See? Hey. <laughs> it, it, your, it's your body. You have to learn where you got to throw works for you. Hey, 
In um, martial arts, there's a, a myth. This is an important myth. Listen up carefully, guys. Keep training. Again. Martial arts is a myth. Because the technique itself will do the job. No, it won't. Okay? Different physiologies have different levers, different bases, taller, longer, limit people. Like, have you guys seen, seen Von Dom's physiology? Short torso, long legs. He's flexible, can kick high, and can, can kick fast. Good, he's a kicker. I have a relatively longer torso compared to my legs, like James Booth, remember him? Yeah, not a kicker. <laughs> that guy can just ground and hit. Okay. So he, he needs to be an upper body defense. Now what was the... Uh... No, that's the principle behind the animals. That's why monkeys fight like monkeys, tigers, like tiger, they fight like apes. I'm not trying to make an ape into a crane. Now back up, Terry. Back up. Stand aside. So he's, he's coming in, he comes in, he's just going to step aside. Here, as he blends, pulls away, follow him, and he goes, and I cut his neck, and cuts the knife. Okay? Stay over here. So, he comes in, you got it? So he will step out to the side. Boom, there you go. And then, ah, good. There. See his name was? And how did you get me? Was the ah, was the sudden boom. You got, this was what threw me. So the that turn, was the turn, the reason, yeah, the reason the turn worked. Well, yeah, if it feels like nothing, yeah, it really it's, more, it's more legit. So I mean, it's here, that, that's the throw. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> that's the throw right there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but when it feels like nothing, you've done it right. If it feels like you're, you're getting right. Like, do something next But if you're doing it, do something. Do something. Stop it, there's nothing crap, right? So people get hurt when you do nothing. Yeah. yeah. That's why I don't kick them. Okay. Because he's doing that. Boom. We're not worrying about the blade. Pulls away. Pulls away. Boom. We're going to here. That's all we're going to. So look where my hand is. Here. That. See, now. Now this hole. Look at that. I don't have to hold it. So I'm going to pull this here and push down there. You got that? Uh, that's that's what they're eating. That, that's just yeah. that quick. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What I like is you get that right and the timing right. That's why it's boom, boom, and then they're done. I mean, this is this why Kung Fu gets all those those bad raps. For this is a move. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's just like, oh, yeah, that's your art. You're 